Let me hear the shout of victory all over this house. Bishop T.D. Jakes leads the Potter's House Church with more than 30,000 members, but he says he wants to go beyond just preaching about faith and making his messages become reality. On Sunday morning, I, I share a message. Uh, through the foundation, I want to see that message made flesh in the lives of people. And I want to see that message of love and hope and possibility to continue to flourish. He's launching a foundation separate from the church that targets working adults as well as students. He wants to create partnerships with businesses and the community to train workers for high-tech jobs in science, engineering, and the arts. How do we bridge the gaps between the people who need it and the opportunities that exist? And how do we better prepare them to accept those positions, whether they're through apprenticeships or short-term courses or what have you? He says pastors and churches are the bullhorns to the community. He says it's important to carry the message to impoverished communities. He says jobs and opportunity are the answer to reducing the epidemic of violence plaguing minority communities, including Dallas. You don't see people hanging out on the street late at night who have to go to work in the morning. He is connecting with CEOs across the country to partner with. Hattie Hill is on the board of the Dallas Regional Chamber of Commerce. She says businesses are in need of diverse talent of women and minorities. It's far greater than it's ever been. And as we, from a chamber perspective, rush out and recruit companies to Dallas, we want them to have great talent at all levels. Hill says what Jakes is trying to do is revolutionary by connecting businesses, faith leaders, and the community. She says it's important to leveling the playing field where minorities are either overlooked and underpaid. It's, it's crisis. We have 700,000 jobs right now that could be filled across the country, and we have millions of people in need of those jobs. Jake says his mission is to provide people hope and opportunity. In Dallas, I'm Rebecca Lopez.